Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. What's up, guys? Gamers. Today, I'm going to be doing a super fun and... Oh, my name's Annika Osterlin. And today, I'm going to be doing a super fun and funky video. I'm going to be... What's upcycling some of the clothes that I have? I'm gonna be making them better. I really like outfit videos. It's fun, it's fun shit. I don't look like this in the video, unfortunately. I look much, much worse. I'm just taking some of the clothes that I already have. I'm gonna be like cropping them. I even did some sewing. I know, I don't know how to sew. And the sewing machine that we have is from 1972. So it's an experience. Yeah, uh, enjoy or don't. The first thing we're gonna be, oh. The first thing we're gonna be upcycling, these sweatpants. I really love these sweatpants when I first got them. Now it's just, they're a little bit too short and I feel like they're kind of weird. So I'm just gonna turn them into shorts. I hope that this will be relatively easy. I don't know if I wanna make them like long shorts. I think shorter shorts will probably be better, but I'm gonna try them on and then mark. I'm not wearing pants. I don't know if you can see. They just look kind of weird on me. I don't know why. They're not baggy enough to be like nice. I don't know. I feel like they'll be cute short. I don't want to cut off the, this whole figure, so I'm probably going to do it like here. Okay. Take them off and cut them. Okay. I don't have fabric scissors with me right now, so um, these are going to have to do. I'm really scared. I don't, I don't like cut it, but also I never wear these, so if I do fuck it up. I'm really scared. I can't even send emails. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. I always get really nervous before I send emails because I'm worried that I like typed something wrong. I don't know. Okay. I'm just going to do it. Wow. I should really be using fabric scissors. I'm doing it. I should also be being like way more precise. Like this is maybe won't be in a straight line. Okay, so now I'm gonna fold it over maybe so I can get like a symmetrical, I don't know. That's a big word. I have like a bunch of video ideas. The thing that I am lacking though is probably the most important thing, which is motivation, I guess is the word that I'm looking for. So, I don't know. Say lovey, carpe diem. Okay, Sarah, Sarah. When she's trilingual. Oh my god, do you see this? They won't cut. <laughs> uh, remember the times we had. You know what? I see why fabric scissors exist now. I feel like they're uneven. Oh, these are kind of cute. They still like aren't the most flattering, but they're kind of cute. Like maybe even if I, I could go in and sew them, maybe that could be cute. But they're cute. They're like gym shorts. Uh, Next thing I'm gonna upcycle is this shirt. Got this from the thrift store. It's from the little girl section. I got it because I really love this little detailing. It fits a little bit awkwardly because the sleeves are so high up. Like my armpits are lower because I am a full sized girl, not a little one. So I'm gonna turn it into a tank top. I'm going to use a Brandy Melville tank top as a reference. I'll try it on for you so you know what I mean. It just looks a little off because the sleeves, I don't know. I just feel like if I, I feel like if I fixed it, it would look better. And I mean, worst comes to worst, I never wear this shirt. I could just rip off those little diamond buttons and use them on something else if it doesn't work out. I'm gonna turn this shirt inside out. I'm really scared. I like literally have no idea what I'm doing. I think first I'm gonna cut off the sleeves. I'm gonna use this tank top because I want it to be thicker straps. So I'm gonna do something like this. The neckline is different, but I'm just kind of using this for the body. Okay, I'm using this blue chalk thing. I should also leave room for seam allowance, right? That's a thing. I don't. I have no idea how to do seam allowance. I, I, I'm lucky that I even know that that's a thing. This is nerve wracking. So there's the front part. I'm gonna cut it out. This fabric cuts much nicer with these scissors. I could also just get fabric scissors. We have them. I think it cuts better for this ribbed. Look at me fucking go. Okay, you know what? I've never done anything like this before. There's the front. <laughs> this is what it'll look like. It's gonna be really cute if this works out. Because if it works out, I really did something there. Now we gotta do the back. You know what? It's okay if it's a little bit janky because I'll just be proud of myself that I even, you know, kind of did this. Should also probably be doing this on a flat surface. I'm just waiting for me to fuck it up. Like at this point, like there's literally no way that this is gonna turn out the way that I wanted to because I don't sew. All right, here's what we got. This is not even. What happened there? Do I fix it and make it even? You know what, I don't think it's gonna matter really. I'm gonna go and grab some pins and then I'm gonna pin it. 
Nope. What the fuck? So I'm gonna turn it inside out again. I'm really special. I don't think you guys understand how nervous I am. This could be really cute, and I'm trying not to get my hopes up because I know me and I know myself. So I got my little my little pin. Oh. How do you pin things? Is this supposed to be the easiest part? I don't think I left enough room for seam allowance. Some mistakes get made. That's all right. That's okay. This is really fun. Are you guys having fun yet? Ow. I suppose myself. I'm, I'm gonna, I'll come back when I'm, I don't know why I started pinning. I don't know why I started pinning the sleeves closed. I'm dumb, I don't, I don't. So I pinned the side closed and then I did a hem on the sleeves, if you can see, they're open. Okay, so now I have to sew. So, we're gonna, we're gonna sew it. This is my mom's mom's sewing machine from 1972, what we're working with today. Okay, okay. What's the thing that I use to push it up? Push it so you push uh, it. Okay. All the way up. She's standing there and watching. I'm just so proud. Yeah. I don't know if that was filming. One edge is done. So now I do the other edge. Don't get too excited on it. This is just the beginning. This is fun. Now I have to do the little hemming part on the sleeves, which I'm really scared for. Okay, here goes nothing, I guess. My phone's gonna die, it's at 1%. <laughs> I'm sewing. I'm sewing. I have this shirt and I'm making a tank top. It'll be cute, I promise. It's for a video. My phone is gonna die, so if I just Are you making a call? Yeah. Are you following a tutorial? No, so I have, um, uh, shut up. No, stop. Don't give me your face. I had a, t I had a long sleeve. I just cut off the sleeves and I'm like hemming it. Watch the TikTok I sent you. Okay, I will. Look at you go, babe. <laughs> oh, my phone just died. It's okay. I told her that would happen. I did that. I did one, I think. Oh, that's kind of fucked up. It's okay. That's okay. It's a thought that counts. It's a thought that counts. And it's on the back, too. Front looks good. <laughs> Stuff. I think I did it. Not bad. It's not bad. Is it even though? I'm gonna try it on. Okay, so I tried it on and it didn't fit quite how I want it to, so I'm just going back and I'm fixing some of it, just sewing it in a little bit tighter. Um, so, you don't know how to sew. Take the pins home, flip it right side out. That looks better. I actually went to sewing camp when I was younger. Um, it was called So Easy. Get it? Because, like, so. <laughs> Try it on. It's still doing the thing. Basically, what it's doing, which I hate, a lot of Forever 21 tank tops do this. It goes out a little bit at the sides, but I, it's much better than it was before. So I think I'm gonna cut my losses and go with this. It doesn't look too shabby. I like my first sewing kind of thing. It looks weird because I'm wearing a shirt under it. That's yeah, cute. Wish that it were more like. I mean, you know what? It's actually pretty good. What does the back look like? I think your back looks fine. I can't see it. I can't believe I did that. <laughs> All right, it's a different day. I look much better. This is how I looked in the intro. Um, Cause I just filmed the intro, so that's how that works. I have this absolute vodka shirt. You might remember this from my, uh, what I would be wearing if I were in quarantine video. I forgot the name of it. And how it didn't really fit me. So I'm gonna do something really simple to this. I actually cropped it, but I'm going to cut it and basically sew it together again. So I think I'm gonna have to try that on. This is what we got. It is an extra large, so I just want it to fit nicer, maybe more like this. I don't know. We'll see what we can do with this. Yeah, okay. Um... You can try it on and pin it, maybe. Yeah, okay. Basically, I just pinned the sides. I tried it on and then I pinned both the things. That ended up being about a two inch. What do you call that? Hem, like, I don't know. I also need to hem the bottom. I need to thread the sewing machine and everything, so I'll see you there. This kind of fabric is harder to work with because it's stretchy. I hope that works. It would be kind of sad if I fucked up this shirt because I actually do really like this shirt. But what are you gonna do? It works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Now we do the other side. 
Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Oh, something happened. Maybe with the bobbin. Can you see that? You know what? Whatever. It's on the inside. But it is what it's on the inside, but count. Hang on, let me try it on. Is it center? Right, so look in the mirror. Alright, I forgot to take a before of this shirt, but this is what it looks like after. I mean, since I know what it looked like before, it fits way better now. Like it used to kind of like go out at the sleeves and now it's more of like a straight cut top. I also hemmed the bottom. Dude, this is great. And it's not, I don't think it's off center. It's not off center. I'm very, I'm very happy. Do you like, do you like my shorts? Yeah. <laughs> I'm very very pleased with myself. I did that. I did that. Now I'm feeling like cocky. I want to like hem my shorts, but I know I won't be able to do that. Let's find something else that I can sew. I'm gonna find something. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. I think that the last thing that I'm going to do today is I'm gonna do something with this shirt, but I just don't wear it. And especially since it's summer now, like, I don't know. I want to make it into like a tank top or something. Um. I don't know how I'm gonna do that. Especially since the fabric is, it's interesting. It's a knit. I got it, I got it. I'll turn it inside out and just start drawing on it, I guess. For the neck, I would want it to be like a little lower. I'll fold it in half so that it's symmetrical. Uh, this is, sorry, I'm really, I'm really special. I don't <laughs> know what I'm doing. Okay, um, I need fabric, so you know what? I don't care. I should really get fabric scissors. You know what, I'm just gonna get fabric scissors really fast. I'm gonna go the best. I felt rushed, so I brought the whole kit. I might need to adjust the sides to fit my body more. I don't know what I'm doing. And I'm just fucking with them. I got nothing to do. Running through these checks like the ones on my shoes, so don't get geeked up. Uh, I just cut way too far. I just cut way too far. It's okay. It's okay. Definitely gonna need to fry this on and pin it, because I feel like it's not gonna fit my body the way I want it. Actually, it might. I don't know. Yeah, I low-key fucked up with the, the armholes and like a muscle tee. But I think that if I stretch it and sew it, right, like that, just kind of doing the same thing as I did with the other shirt, fitting it to my body and then pinning it. I did not leave enough room for seam allowance on the top, so I don't know how that's gonna work out. Maybe I'll leave it as a raw hem. Same with this. Well, I really didn't think that through. Maybe I'll leave it as a raw hem. Um, okay, I'm gonna sew. All right, it is much better. It fits way better now. Like. This is cute. Kind of like a gnarly fabric to sew, but you know, I think it works. looks pretty clean. Like, I'm proud of myself. I'm really mad though that I didn't leave seam allowance. So my message to you, triple check if you've left seam allowance before you cut. Don't, don't just go and cut. I don't know why I did that. There is a tiny, tiny bit, but if I were to sew, then I think it would go over the gold. So I don't know what to do. But I think it's fine like this. It's really comfortable and I fixed the like sleeve thing. It's not a muscle tee anymore. My boobs aren't like coming out the side. This is a, this is a W in my opinion. Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i had a lot of fun making it um let me know if you want more outfit videos i know i'm not like the most crafty but um i do enjoy crafting this is stupid i don't know what to say anyway that's the video thanks for watching fuck bitches get money love you tell me that i'm an idiot you know that you'll be lying what